Hello, my name is David Ribich, and sitting here with me today are three of my teammates, Parker Marson, Tyler Jones, and Kennedy Rufner. All three are going to be racing this weekend in Indiana at the National Championships for Cross Country. So Kennedy, we'll start with you. Take me through this regional meet and kind of the last two weeks preparing for the national meet. Okay. Um, well, I knew going to the regional meet that I was going to be on the bubble and trying to qualify as an individual. Um, and so there was just a point in the race where I really had to s decide that I have to stick with this front group and I need to, I need to go because I was planning on qualifying for nationals all year. And so it worked out and it happened. So that's good. Um, these last two weeks have just been like a few workouts, some long rounds, just kind of keeping up with pace and mileage, not doing too much, not doing anything too much differently, I would say, but just getting really prepared. So in that preparation, you're going to be racing against people that you haven't seen all year or potentially ever. Will you be looking for those familiar faces in the crowd during the regional meet? Yeah. At I, the national meet? Yeah, I definitely am I, I'm aware of some of the people that are going to be in the race, and um, I'll definitely be looking out for them. And But I'm going to try my best just to run my own race and not worry about them and just try and s stick up as close to the front group as possible, I guess. <laughs> So you'll, you're going to be joining the men's team in which qualified um, entirely. How's that dynamic going to work? I mean, you're going to be with <laughs> us and, and a couple other guys. Um, you know, we'll hope for the best. <laughs> um, it'll be fun, you know. I'm, I'm just excited and thankful to be going. So I think that outweighs it. <laughs> yeah, well, that definitely outweighs it. Congratulations for qualifying. Thank you. So we'll go to Tyler Jones. Tyler Jones, you're a junior. This is your first national meet, and you're kind of the center of the team. You have incredible upperclassmen, you know, David Ribich, an outstanding <laughs> athlete, and Dustin, or er, Josh Dempsey. And then you're, you're joined as a junior with Dustin Nading. So going into this national meet, is this national meet going to be a, a common goal for you going into the years to follow? For sure, yeah. I'm hoping that, like, obviously this is my first national meet, that there will be a few more to follow in my career at Western whether it's in like indoor 3K or outdoor 5K. So that's definitely the goal for the future. So now that you're kind of more comfortable with 10Ks, would you say that you would want to do a 10K eventually on the track? <laughs> probably not. That seems <laughs> a bit too many laps. Yeah. 5K is probably my max on the track. But. So we'll just, we'll just focus on this weekend then. So going into this weekend, <laughs> do you have any specific race plans or tactics going in? Uh, me, Parker, Justin, and Josh have just been working really well together during the races. So the goal is to just stick it out with those guys and then just try and hammer the last 2K. Are you familiar at all with the um, highest ranked finish for Western Oregon University history? As a team? Yeah. I am not aware. <laughs> Well, it's 14th, and, you know, I think with this year especially, this team is strong enough and deep enough to where that is a possibility. Um, so congratulations to you as well as advancing as a team. Thank you. Parker Marson, you know, we all see each other every single day, and there was a big switch that happened uh, right after the regional meet, and it has something to do with your hair, or lack of. Uh, kind of take me through, what was the purpose behind that? Um, well, a long time ago in August, we were on a long run on a Sunday, and we were all running as a group, uh, probably about 15 guys, and uh, we were just chatting along, and I randomly, for no good reason, said, hey, you know what, guys, if we make the national meet, I'll shave my head bald, and, um, you know, you and I shook on it, which was a terrible decision uh, on my part. And so now I'm bald because we made the national meet and everyone got to take a go at shaving my head and that was fun, but I ended up liking being bald. So I think I'm going to keep it. So you've, you've kind of made like a, wait, did you say you're going to keep it? Uh, <laughs> yes. Okay. Definitely. Um, any significant others or family members that disagree with that? Yes, or? I do have a, uh, my partner definitely doesn't enjoy <laughs> me being bald. So that's uh, <laughs> definitely something so that's adverse. We'll switch back to the, the team dynamic then. So. <laughs> Last year and the year prior, you were, you were kind of on like an injury, um, yeah. very injury prone, weren't really like, I'm sorry, contributing that deep as a team. Absolutely. And coming into this year, you came out with fire. Kind of take me through this last three months for you personally because this has been a year, a year for you and a good starting point for the rest of the year. Yeah, well, I mean, I was injured for about nine months, and so that gave me the ability to really 
uh, rebuild myself as an athlete. And so I just got, um, I kind of changed my mental uh, approach to racing and practice, as well as I got to change my body, uh, my body physically. So that was really nice. And um, this year I've got to race a lot and I've gotten a lot of good experience running in the front of races, especially before we raced as a team together this year, early in the season. And so just working through every race, I've been you know, doing my job like we always say, and you know, my, my goal is to just be better every single race. So. Do you have any specific job going into this weekend? Um, I think you know, this weekend for me and for a lot of us, it's our first national race. And so for me, my job is, you know, it's my first, no, my first national meet as well. And um, I just wanna make the guys feel as comfortable as possible when we're in that race. And so like Tyler said, you know, uh, me, him, Josh, and Justin, you know, when we're together, I'm just gonna try to do what we've done all season, run together and, you know, be as comfortable as possible with each other and just make it like another race. Nice. No, those are great answers. And, and again, uh, you can follow us along on our journey to the national meet in Indiana. We leave tomorrow at 6 a.m., right? 6, <laughs> yep. 6 a.m. Right so be a bright and early uh, start to the trip, but follow us along. All of us race on Saturday. Women are first, correct? Yes. yes. Yep, women are first, uh, men are second. The links will be posted along with this. And yeah, just go Wolves and go Western Oregon cross country. Thank you to Parker Marson, Tyler Jones, and Kennedy Rufner.